Hello everybody and welcome to episode 18 of the Disgaea PC LP, starting off right where we left off. So yeah, I got pissed and kicked him right there. There? Where is there? You know. Mm -hmm. Oh my! So what happened after that? Well, of course. Hmm? What is that? A photo? Someone must have dropped it. <laughs> oh my! Is this Laharo? <laughs> oh. <laughs> hmm. <gasps> There's something written on the back. What are you two laughing about? I can hear you from across the castle. But, but, but Prince, <laughs> look at this! <laughs> Just a picture? What's so... <gasps> I think this is possibly one of my favorite sprites of Laharl, where it's just pure rage. I didn't know you were into that kind of thing. I'm a bit shocked. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? It's a humiliating photo of you. I can say that, but who the hell took it? How should I know? By the way, something's written on the back. What? Dear Prince Laharl, Prince an embarrassing photo of you is in my possession. I await your arrival in Jotunheim. If you choose to decline my challenge, copies of the photo will be scattered throughout the netherworld. It is my wish to contend for overlordship in a fair, agreeable manner. Damn it! Fair, agreeable manner? This is playing dirty! But isn't that the demon way? True, but this crosses the line! So, are you going or not? It's definitely a trap. Of course I'm going! If this picture is spread throughout the netherworld, I'll be ruined! Whoever you are, you just wait! I'll char you and your paparazzi shots in the eternal flames of hell! Episode 5, Etna's Secret. See, I'm wondering what the photo was. <laughs> um, there's some gem with a black confidence. One thing my next must be hard prints. Things have a warmy hand. <laughs> That's a good one. I do like how no one wants to help him. Supreme of the of Larry is more powerful than all others, but they say the others more spice and the Lord of Terror. No such thing as someone stronger than the Overlord, that's just a legend. I'm pretty sure that's a ball. Um. I'm wondering if maybe in Edna's secret room there's a... Bathroom, okay? There it is. Yeah, and this is how you uh, unlock uh, Etna mode regularly. Secret chamber, only Anna had in here. Not much pressure. Memories locked away. I can't remember. I can't remember what they were when I try to remember my heartaches. Pants poop. How do those memories are to me? I have to get them back. Okay. Yep. Uh, in each chapter, they updates with one thing. And I was just trying to figure out how to do it last time. Uh, okay. Uh, do do do. Let's go. Okay, she's specifying the challenge. Was Joan Hunt correct? Why is someone wrong? Well, the gate leads there is being opened from the other side as someone's waiting for you. Confident foe is me very well. This may be a trap. I'll enjoy it anyway. Let's go, Joan Hunt. Absolute zero. Okay, cool. Um, phew, attack minus 50. Ally damage 20%. Okay. Um, I'm just going to assist myself using. I'm 
only using these guys to expedite this map. Uh, because I don't want to waste too much time doing this. And the attack minus 50. That's way over there. Great. Uh, defense plus 50. Now I don't have to worry about, um... Now I don't have to worry about the ally damage very much. Which takes off some of the worry. But... There's kind of some worries in... No negative effects. This is where it really starts to pick up the geo points and whatnot. Um, okay. Rush. Okay. I love. You don't need to be on the field anymore. Could easily be useful, but I don't want him to be. Because I need him to get XP. Like, so one interesting thing is if you don't go to the doctor between uh, maps, the, even the stats effects carry over. Like, I went into one battle with. Uh, did I just clip through there? Don't surprise me. Uh, like, I went into one battle with, uh, like, three of my people all paralyzed because I didn't uh, think I needed to go back. I just thought I didn't start with full health. Imp. Who are these guys? I was looking forward to seeing what terrifying trap awaited me, but instead I find these puny little demons. Imp. What? You got something to say? A wonderful life. <gasps> World peace! <laughs> Let's all be friends. S stop that! Girls take initiative! <laughs> Wah! Laharo? What's wrong? Oh, him? Oh, he hates it when people are optimistic. Hmm. Is that so? Let's see. Eternal love. Oh, 
my weakness. Our stats have temporarily decreased. Fantastic. And I'm wondering our stats. Uh, we should be able to ego it fine. I'll just uh, come here. Pop her. So we got to the point where just he just won't be able to avoid everybody now. I believe by turn basis, so if he runs out of it, then it will not continue. Come up here, Blade Rush. Um, I'm not sure whether this affects gun strength or not. So I'm gonna do it anyway. Because their stats are dependent on speed and hit. But I'm gonna try to do this. Yeah, didn't really do anything. Um, so I got Hog Miser back. Um, yeah, I guess I can start using my printies now. Uh, just because they're. I just never leveled them up really. <laughs> so they're all low level. But that's just like the pattern in most Disgaea games. Where I just. I just generally don't use printies. Because they're kind of pointless. Like, that, that's why you can just heal them for one hell, because they're super basic. Huff, huff. Are you alright? Barely, you nearly finished me by saying that. I mean, eternal love. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Doing that on purpose, aren't you? Prince, this is the time to be fooling around. We have to get that photo back. I think I don't know that. Uh, dots. Are you sure that we can allow this to continue? If I thought something needed to be done, I would have done it long ago. I have faith in her. Okay, Chuckle, you worry needlessly, but I understand I shall take measures just in case. Okay. Time to heal them up after that. Uh, let's see. Just checking my equipment. Yeah, you're good. Yeah, for the most part. Uh, I guess I can equip you with better footwear. Might as well spend some money. It doesn't hurt. Only really helps. Okay, I was checking because I didn't know if uh, it added any SP. And always want to be if, always want to be full on that. Okay. So basically, because we went through Edna mode first, we kind of have a general idea of what is going on for the most part. But you learn more about the Harl. Oh, what a cute little boy! For some apparent reason, I can't stand women with
with sexy bodies. On a side note, flat-chested girls like you have absolutely no effect on me. Have to add that side note, don't you? Well, excuse us for being flat. Mm. Who is that? <laughs> you haven't met him before. Y you're... It has been a while, Prince. Do you still remember me? How could I forget you? You're Medeiros, the vassal who was banished from the castle for stealing my old man's favorite snack, black pretzels. <sighs> now that's what I call pathetic. So, Black Pretzel Snatcher slash Outcast, what is it that you want from me now? I wish to become Overlord, of course. <laughs> what a joke! What could you, a pathetic loser banished for stealing pretzels, possibly do to me? Stop talking so tough, Prince. I know all of your weaknesses. Isn't that right, Edna? Shock. Edna, you? <laughs> you just realized it. Fool! Yes, Edna is my loyal dog. As long as I hold her memory in my hands, she'll do whatever I ask. Edna? Now, dear prince, this place shall become your grave. Etna, you've served your purpose. I am quite pleased with the results. Now die alongside your prince. But we had a deal! What about my memory? What use are memories to you when you are about to die? <laughs> It all makes sense now. No wonder he knew my weaknesses. You took those photos too, didn't you? Laharu, it was only because that demon stole her memory. Silence! I accept no excuses from a traitor! Stop blabbering and get these sexy women out of my sight! Okay. So, that, that was one of the main... Oh yeah, this fucking stage. Um, what was its gimmick again? There's... yeah. So everything is invincibility, except for this. So you have to get here and throw this to here. So stupid. Um, okay. So that means... Uh, I guess... I, have to, I, have to, I just have to do a chain of throws. Um, and then you, uh, see, this is uh, this is one where it would kind of suck if you didn't have uh, if you didn't have many human characters. Honestly, not sure how. F like, I don't know how many throws I'm gonna need, so I'm going to just put as many people out there so that the last person hasn't used their move, or hasn't walked. That way, they'll be able to walk once they land. But with advanced throwing tech, I should be able to get there relatively fast. Now, the trouble starts. Okay. And now, we can attack. But guess what? We've used all, literally like, all our people. Um, and the level 14. Uh, okay. I just wanted to check around. This is going to be one of the least effective maps for some levels. Yeah. So everyone is super OP as of right now. And there 
they're all kind of just spread out. Put him down here, execute. Okay, did 150. Uh, weak to 5, that's good. That's a knock over. Over here, there's a power of love on him. See, invincibility is an interesting one because you can you can do a map like this where it, it's it, it's an interesting map. It's just annoying because you have to deal with it. Um, Easy enough stage. Just had to take a little bit of time to set everything up. Still only took about like two minutes, I think. Okay. And then so I'll have to redo it. Oh, this is a game where frequently saving is awesome. I don't even think anyone has died yet in this run through, so I don't even have to worry about team kills. Mm -hmm. You don't know when to give up, do you, Prince? But. Your luck ends here. Hi there, little boy. That's not all. Take this! A ray of hope. Ah! A pure heart. Stop it! <laughs> Can you withstand an attack against both of your vulnerabilities? Oh, hold it right there! When a lovely flower sheds a tear, I am there to wipe its sadness away. My flower shall bloom bearing love! He reminds me of James from Team Rock. They call me the Dark Adonis! Who are you? What is your name? Just As I said, I am the Dark Adonis. I don't care who you are. Interfere, and you shall regret it. You don't care who he is, why'd you ask his name? My! You are the one who asked moi for my name. In any case, I am not here to see you. Now then, how is everyone doing? You seem to be having some difficulty. What are you here for? Oh, how can you be so discourteous to moi? You seem to be working your way into quite a predicament. As your rival, I felt it was my obligation to warn you. Warn me? Laharl, do not be fooled by appearances. Relying on sight and sound will only lead to delusion. Open your mind's eye. Once you do, you will no longer be deceived by mere facades. My mind's eye? Now is the time to set your mind free. Awaken to your power! Um... Mr. Midboss, that was a wonderful speech and all, but I think you may have set the bar a bit too high for Laharl. Oh, in that case, just close your eyes and plug your ears. <laughs> now I have no weaknesses. The tides have turned, Madaris. Hmm. Etna, what are you waiting for? Kill Laharl! If you refuse, I'll erase your memory for good. Why don't you? What? Two years ago, when the king died, I followed your orders and poisoned the prince so that you would give me back my memories. What? You tried to poison me? Then that long nap was all because of. Your ears are plugged, yet you still managed to hear that one line? That's right. It was because of the poison, but. I hated myself for working under Medaris. I didn't want to go on living like that. So, I devised a plan to escape from under his thumb. Vivin, 
Why have you been following my orders until now? <laughs> you mean it's not clear to you? Let me explain it then. I was waiting for just the right moment to get my revenge on the bastard who ruined my life. From now on, I'll lead my life any way I choose. And no one's gonna stop me. How dare you turn against me, you double-crossing backstabber! Ah, the whining of a sore loser. It's music to my ears. Damn it! Brinnies, make mincemeat out of her! Dude! P Brinnies? You don't get it, do you? I just told you that I've been waiting for this moment. I bought out the Prinnies you hired to watch over me a long time ago. Comprende? You're just a stupid fool who fell for my trap. And the prince was my bait. Huh. Using me as bait? You're one ruthless girl. Oh, Prince, don't flatter me so much. It's not like Flan or Midboss were part of the plan. Hmm, women are scary. <sighs> From this day on, you're gonna pee in your pants every time you hear my name. You ready? Okay, so this... Uh, as you can probably tell, Atmino is just kind of using, uh, or just used, most of the same assets from the past one. Like, we're starting where the map ended, uh, when we were fighting against Medeiros. Um, okay. There's not that. Good. Uh, fly right there. through this real quick. Triburst doesn't seem to be all that good. Uh, remove uh, Laharl over here to me. Come over here, Power of Love. And then Braveheart just to keep the stack going. Honestly, one of the most simple maps in this entire For, stage. Forgive me! Please, spare my life! I beg you! What should I do? Forgive me, oh Master Etna! Your strength, beauty, and intelligence are unsurpassed in all the netherworld! Well, killing a loser like you would only dirty my hands, so I'll forgive you. You know what I want, right? 
Y yes! I will return Masala Harald's candid photos immediately, as well as your memory. I'll return everything. Another succumbed fear and pleasure to Anna. Now she's trying to try part of that consent. Ooh, well that settles that, doesn't it, Prince? No, it doesn't. You tried to poison me in my sleep. You used me as bait for your revenge. What kind of vessel are you? But, 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 but I don't mind that side of you. A true demon is always full of ambition and aims for the top. As king, I'll need a right-hand demon like you under my command. Prince! Listen up! I'm gonna work you into the ground. You better be prepared for it. Uh-uh. You better be prepared. I'll be watching your every move. If you don't prove yourself worthy of the throne, an accident may happen. Hmph. Huh. You can take my place if that happens. <laughs> don't worry. I will. That's strange. Laharl and Etna reconciled, despite all that's happened. I don't understand it, but I guess demons have their own way of expressing love. <laughs> I'm really surprised. I have never experienced anything like this before in Celestia. And that was the end of episode five. Okay. Hey, wait! Everyone! Are you not forgetting someone? Oh yeah, you were here. <laughs> Now it's the end of episode five. Okay. Uh, next episode. Hi, everybody. I'm Etna. I'm a first grader at Netherworld Elementary. You look and act like a first grader, that's for sure. Um, my dream is to become a witch so I can get a cute boyfriend. Boyfriend? That's dumb. Lovely sexy. Hey, no touching! Boys of the world, be my loyal slaves! Who'd want to touch you? Next on Evolutionary Magical Girl Etna, Episode 6. Curse you, Flan! Get ready to be spellbound! Aren't you embarrassed to say something like that? Not at all. <laughs> okay. So with that, I'm going to end this episode here. Uh, this might just become a trend where I end episodes and begin them on the save screen. So with that, I hope you all have a very nice day.